This Tuit skill is in hardware and focuses on the combination of a document camera and smart board tools. A document camera has its own software which allows you to write over the image. However, Smartboard Tools is a more robust feature set. So let's see how these work in conjunction with each other. I have a document camera here and it is showing some student work. I'm going to show you the tools that come with the software and those are basically a hand-free drawing which you can draw, line, rectangle, ellipse, we also have a text tool, copy, and eraser tool. I'm going to go back up to the settings up here and minimize this toolbar up here. I'm going to show you how they work in conjunction with the SmartBoard tools. So I'm going to bring these out and if I want to do any writing I could either select the writing tool or I could just stay in the arrow tool and pick up a pen. So I'm going to pick up the red pen and notice that I'm already in ink layer and I can just draw a line to say that this is an indent and this is another indent. I can put the pen down and pick up the eraser and erase anything that I want. Put the eraser down. When I'm done annotating, if I don't want them anymore, I just click on it and on the board and it disappears. If I want to highlight anything, I'll pick up a pen and this time I'm going to choose the highlighter tool over here and let's say I want to stay with yellow and I can just highlight any word that I want and it will highlight that. Put the pen down and on the top right I can click the X up here and it will make that go away. If I want to select anything and just show, well let's just take a look at this one sentence, I can use the spotlight tool. So when I click on this I can move um, where the spotlight goes and typically with writing I want to have a rectangle and I can just focus on this one sentence. If I also want to in context I will change the transparency by choosing the drop down and maybe changing it to 25 percent. That way when I move to the next sentence down here I can still see the others slightly but my focus is directly on that one sentence. I'll click the drop down and exit out of that. If I want to keep one of these sentences then I can directly put that into notebook and I'll use that by opening up my screen capture toolbar. Right now it's set to capture to a new page and I just want to grab one sentence. To do that I'll select the area select and just choose one of the sentences. Go from one corner to the next and let go and it will automatically put that into notebook. I don't have to save any file it's just nice and easy with the workflow. If I want this whole area in here, a very simple way is using the window capture and I just tap on the window and it takes a picture of it. If I just want a word, I just select the freehand capture and if I select the word wrong, I will just draw a circle around it basically and it will freehand capture just that one area. To show you what these look like, I'll go into notebook. Here is the word wrong that I freehand captured. I'll go into the previous page. Here's the window that I captured that had all of the student work on it. And the first one that I did was the first sentence that I have. And so I have that in notebook. So those are just some ways that you can use the SmartBoard tools in conjunction with a document camera. Now it's time for you to get to it.